though. Tell me what's going on today. I left for two hours. You went where? To go to Walmart and get feed. And get gas. And get gas. The truck. So I could get to Walmart and feed. And this what happened? happened. This. Yes. This happened right here. Okay, guys. I screwed up. So let me explain what's up with this little one. <sighs> okay. This is Hershey's baby. And it's the littlest one that we've been bottle feeding. And she was doing really good. And today it's like 70 degrees, 80 degrees. It's 70 something. Really nice. I mean, I had a sweater on earlier, but nothing terrible, terrible. And I got to feeling really bad because Hershey's babies and Hershey and Reba have not been out in a week. And they need sunlight, just like humans do. We need sunlight to fight depression. We need sunlight to, um, for our vitamins and neutral, nu uh, nutrition. And so I decided, since RJ was running to go get the feed, I had kind of a headache and I just, I wanted them to enjoy the nice weather. So I literally kicked everything out of the barn, which we just moved them to a smaller pen. Um, wasn't anything we haven't done a hundred times over but and we did the same exact thing last year um, with Hershey when she has her issues of learning to take her babies and we realized that in the beginning she didn't have enough milk now the biggest one is um I'm kind of windblown I'm sorry the biggest one is taking more of the milk so we supplement this little one but when I turned them out baby girl is super protective and her and snow are out there and snow doesn't have a baby and she doesn't want to be a babysitter and she yeah she she's not bred this year she's last year's lamb and so this little one Hershey doesn't answer her because she's on a bottle and doesn't smell like Hershey's milk Hershey tolerates her which is fine because then she gets a chance to be a little sheep you know and go out and come in well, she's also the littlest one in the pen. And uh, Baby Girl and Snow, they seem to do fine. They greeted her, um, they greeted the other one too. Not a big deal, huh? And uh, so they greeted her and, and I thought, oh, everything's fine. I watched for a little bit. I got some really cute footage. That, and I'll put some of that in right here. seems normal right so I come in the house and I'm thinking they're doing fine and all of a sudden I start hearing it and it's within like just a few minutes and I start hearing this bath that is a panic bath well I went outside and this little thing here was through the fence which um, that's not a big thing they, they do it all the time it's that woven wire and uh, so she was through the fence I picked her up put her back in and noticed she's limping I thought, well, maybe it's just my imagination. Maybe she's just a little stiff, huh? So, I uh, put her back over there with Hershey. I picked her up and put her back with Hershey. And um, and she seems to be getting really warm right now. Is your body temp right kind of small? You need to be down active? Um, anyway, when I watched this time, I paid closer attention because I thought she was limping, but I wasn't sure she was limping. And then all of a sudden, she was holding her little leg up. As I watched, Snow and Baby Girl um, kind of took to beating on her. So when she could get away, it was before. Hey, 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 hey. She's getting warm. 
um, she could uh, get away and it was no big deal. Well, now with her little limp, she's having trouble getting away from them. So, I screwed up by putting her out there so early and her being a half bottle baby. Um, so, now she's a whole bottle baby, huh? Yes. And she'll be probably our ambassador this year. Poor little leggy. Mm, I know. Um, but she is a cute little booger. And she, let's see here. I'm trying to get it so you guys can see. So this will be my compadre, my friend. Um, we have an engagement tomorrow where I was going to take a little lamb anyway. And we had discussed taking her anyway. So, yeah, we'll just take her bottle and her. Yes. We'll take her bottle and her. And so she's a little <sighs> upset. But she's calmed down now. I gave her a bottle. You know, she's chewing. She's my girl. So, anyway, just saying every year is a learning year. Every year is something different. <sighs> Last year it worked. This year it didn't. So, we'll take care of her. It's not broke. It's not anything. I think she, they just hit it in the right place. And it's kind of stiff. Um, she does look funny trying to hop, though. Don't you, big girl? I know. Um, so anyway, she's my buddy. We screwed up. <laughs> no, I screwed up. Let me be very clear. This is all my doing. I thought they'd be better off outside getting a little vitamins from the sun. And she'll get to go out and play a lot. She just won't be able to do it with the big sheepies, huh? With the big sheepies. And for the record, she weighs over six pounds now, don't you? Yeah, she's a six pounder. She's doubled her weight, almost, almost. So, yeah, she's a six pounder. Anyway, that's the story of this year's little baby and mama screw up, so. Is what okay, it is. Okay, so what happened? Well, mom brought her in the house, put a cover. Look at this, folks. 